Yeah, that's right. We're back in Minecraft again, and today I'm cheating on Treoris with another professor. He's not as beautiful, but he has some good work going. Welcome to No Mo Ghost Co., which is pretty much a budget version, the Minecraft version, of Ghostbusters. And apparently the ghosts that we need to get rid of are extremely annoying because this map is called Extremely Annoying Ghosts. <laughs> Actually, there's one right here. Oh my goodness, what is wrong with this guy's face? Is that a nose? Oh, oh no, that's that's not nice. His lips as well. Why do I like that? Evacuate test subjects. No, 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 I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Where are they going? Where are they going? Where are they going? What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? Uh, sir, boiling tooth. I'm so sorry they're gone. They're literally, oh no, I've already ruined the whole thing. Well, since I have ruined the whole thing, we should probably start the map. Let's open the book and click to start annoying Ghosts. Hello, sir. Hey, I'm Benedict and welcome to No Mo Ghosts Co. Hello, sir. What is wrong with your face? You've seen too many ghosts, haven't you? Here at No Mo Ghosts Co, we take pride in our work, which if you were not aware, primarily involves the removal of any unruly spirits from our customers' homes. You knew that. Hey, you knew that, right? I hope you did because you're contractually obligated to work for me. Anyways, I just received a call this morning from a client looking to get an infestation taken care of in a property they purchased just outside of town. They promised good pay, so we better take good care. Now, when you're ready to head out, just let me... You calm down. When you're ready to head out, just let me know. I'll give you a quick rundown of everything once we're there. All right, have fun. I don't know what this error is. What's going on here? Ha ha ha. Found you. Get out of here. I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's trust this man with our life and let's take this van and get out of here. It looks like they've drawn um, their logo in Microsoft Paint, which ain't too bad. Could be worse, <laughs> but let's get out of here. Oh, hello. All right, you may have already know this, but my name is Ben. I, you just told me this, Benedict. Your first assignment is at this house here, Norman Estates, which our client has recently purchased. But while he was in the process of renovating it, he faced some difficulties. Are we talking ghosts here, my friend? Basically, the house is haunted. All right, let me show you my equipment, okay? What you got for me, sir? You have a few things. First, vacuum cleaner. Right click with the Suckamonga 3000 and then hover over the ghost to begin sucking it up. Okay, that looks like a pretty nifty piece of equipment. Second, you have this headset radio. With this, I'll be able to walk you through the entirety of the mansion whilst in the comfort of my own home. Great, Benedict. He's gonna be all comfy and I'm gonna be sucking up ghosts. You also have a nifty, spooky ghost navigation bar that will lead you to each of your objectives. Oh yeah, I can see it. That's that's really cool. The XP bar. Uh. Anyway, I'll stay in touch with you through the radio. All right then, I'm going to go now. Get out of here, Benedict, and your wonky eye. I think that's a fake eye. He's got one eye missing and then he stuck uh. it on his face. There should be a small path right beside the steps leading to the front door. This should take you directly to the basement door, which is where you'll begin your expedition. Have fun, find and capture a ghost. What? What is happening? <laughs> that ain't no helicopter. Okay, so long story short, we have ourselves a Suckamonga 3000, which we use to suck up our foes, also known as the Annoying Ghosts. And we also have a headset radio so that Benedict can talk to us and talk us through the mansion, which is great. And then this thing at the bottom shows us where the ghosts are, I think. And this is the mansion that we need to suck all of the ghosts out of. This is... This is one impressive house. He's only bought it recently, tried to renovate it, and all of the ghosts decided to um, eat his uh, eat his paintbrushes. Uh, I think I need to go this way, actually. Follow the dirty path, follow the dirty path. I think I need to go here. Yep, here we go. Is that a ghost? Is this a ghost? Yeah. Hey, it looks like that's your first ghost. Hold the Sucker Monger 3000 in your hand and right click it to activate it. Then once it's on, position yourself close to the ghost. Wait a few moments and boom! You captured your first ghost. What is up with our faces? Get it, get it, get it, get in, get in, get in! Why is it hitting me? Ow! <laughs> Got him. Objective complete. Captured a ghost. Is there some kind of open mic night happening here? Some kind of gig? It's the wither storm. It's just having a great time. Well done, your first captured ghost. All right, I'm looking at a map of the house at the moment. It looks like your next stop should be the pool. I've rerouted your navigation bar. I've rerouted your navigation bar to point towards it. Try looking there for any paranormal activity. 
Uh, let's go and find another ghost. Is there anything, any secrets in here? Anything I can steal? Because I don't think I'm getting paid for this, you know. Let's go and find ourselves another little ghost. Is this a painting room? I'm slightly concerned as to what this mansion is even doing. This guy's... Trying to sing us a song. There's nine ghosts in here? Oh, yeah, I can find it through here, can't I? Through the navigation system. He's definitely... He's definitely this way. But whereabouts? Wow. It looks like there's something in the hop tub down there. You should go investigate. There he is! Look at his nose! I need to get down there. How do I get down? Where are the stairs at? The stairs in here? This place is pretty mega, actually. This must have cost millions, surely. I need the stairs. Where are the stairs? How do I get down? This is up. I don't want to go up. I want to go down. Ah, here we go. Look at you. <laughs> this guy's face is unreal. Wait, uh, there's a ghost in the hot tub? There certainly is. Get sucked. Come here. Why can't I? Why can't I get him? I can't get him. What's going on? My name is the hot tub ghost. I live in a hot tub. I see that. I see that. You're not supposed to be in here, though. Can you just vacuum him up right now instead of letting him do his annoying little introduction? Yeah, sure, I'm trying, but I can't do it. His nose, his nose is being sucked in by the vacuum, but I can actually do it. What do you say? Vacuum me up? Ha, huh. you can't do that whilst I'm lounging in this comfortable hot tub. Although I guess it isn't a very hot tub, if you know what I mean, without a working heater. I'd like to take a nap right about now, but I'll need some hot water. Can you turn on the generator so I can have a nice hot tub? Are you kidding me? What kind of job is this? <laughs> the room which houses the generator's main power switch can't be accessed through the door because it's locked. So we need to swim through the water filter to get in. Is this, is this guy joking? Is he joking? From there, you can access the switch and turn on the power for the natatorium, which means nice and hot water for me. Ah. Hey, if he falls asleep, you could probably vacuum him up. Yes, Benedict, I'm sure I can. But first, I've got to do his dirty work. Where is the filter? Is the filter in the pool? <laughs> what did you say? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, jeez, I'm underneath. This is slightly awkward. Like, incredibly awkward. I'm meant to be vacuuming up these ghosts. Uh, changing room. Utility room could probably work. Uh, oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Why am I why am I opening changing room doors? That's weird. There's going there's only gonna be ghosts in here anyway. Utility room. Oh, he said it's locked. Find the utility room and activate the natatorium's backup generator. I'm in the utility room. But I can't get in the utility room, if that makes sense. I'm still pretty amazed by this guy's nose. It looks like the door to the utility room is locked. How inconvenient. Check to see if there's any other route in, perhaps through the pool. Like, as in pool water? Oh, there might actually be. I don't know if I can get through there, though. Can I? There is a way through. But I can't get my skinny body through there. Oh. Oh. I got through. I don't actually know how I got through. But I did. <laughs> Apparently, you can fit through one high blocks in this game. I've turned into a very, very tiny person. Maybe I'm a ghost myself. Who knows? But I need to get to the Natatatorium. And I have no idea where it is. Oh, wait. It, it's, it's here. Main power for Natatorium generator. Hey! I feel like they made up that word, didn't they? Nata, natatorium. Is that where you keep natas? The changing room is... Oh, it's open! Let's go! Wow, that was fast. He's already sleeping. <laughs> you should be clear to suck him up. Come here, boy. Come into my vacuum. Bop! Ah, <laughs> gotcha. This map is cool. I like it. The concept is awesome. Congratulations, you captured another ghost. Before we leave the basement, we should probably head in the direction of the kitchen to be sure we haven't missed anything. I plotted it on your navigation bar. Search more ghosts in the basement. I didn't know I could get down further. I haven't seen any stairs yet. I've seen stairs up, but not down. Let me follow this navigation. Oh, wait, kitchen. Nope, nope, no. Nope. I don't want to turn the vacuum on. Stop. Stop! What was that noise? <laughs> wow, this salami is so good. Hello? Oh my goodness, he's massive. What was that? It sounded like it came from the kitchen. It could be a ghost. Let's go check it out. Oh my goodness! Bro! Hi, I'm Ham Jerry and really like eating salami. What? <laughs> Hello, Ham Jerry. You are a beautiful... Oh, you do. There's so much salami on the floor. Hey, do you know why they call me Ham Jerry? Because you eat ham. You've eaten so much that you're bloated. Is it because you like eating ham? He's got a booger as well. Surprised he hasn't eaten that. And he's got SpongeBob teeth. How beautiful. Distasteful much? No, it's because I eat salami slices. He's got this, this upper class ham right now. That doesn't make much sense. 
And what is in here? Like some... Oh, are they pancakes? I could go for some pancakes right now. Right, Ham Jerry. I need to, um... I need to vacuum you up. I need to put you in my sucker manga. Sounds a bit weird. Hey, what? I had like six more slices of salami and now they're just gone. Did you eat them? No, that... There's plenty of salami on the floor. Why do you think we would eat your rotten old salami? Besides, company policy requires that I fire an employee who eats rotten salami. I'm sure my ghost hunters care more about their jobs than some dumb meat slices. Of course they did. You're a salami-eating liar. Is he accusing me of eating his ham? Why would you ask my opinion if it didn't matter to you? Yeah. Yeah, ham, Jerry. Answer that one. Because you're annoying. <laughs> And you also ate my salami. I didn't, I swear. I'm telling you, we did not eat the salami. Look, do you want us to go to the store and buy more for you? Really? No, I'm mad and nothing you will do will be able to calm me down. Maybe some more salami. Why are you even mad? There's ham everywhere. And isn't ham the exact same thing as salami? Just with a different name? There is a lot of ham. Oh, I see. This is ham, not salami. No, ham is not the same thing as salami. Are you some kind of meat racist? Oh, Jesus, it's getting intense. I'm done with this. You took my salami, and now you have faced the wrath of my magical flying ham slices. Vacuum up ham, Jerry. Ow, ow, no, come here. Come here right now. Ham, Jerry, come here. Oh, jeez, how is he gonna fit in this vacuum? He's coming close. It's working. <laughs> He threw ham at my face. Oh, what's that? Floor two has been unlocked. We've got six ghosts to go. This is awesome. Can I go in here yet? I want to go in. I want to see what ham Jerry was doing. Oh, no. What was that? Whoa. Was that an explosion? Was it? Whatever it was, it sounded like it came from outside. Go upstairs and try to locate its source. I have a feeling a ghost might be behind it. Find and remove the source of the explosion. This is a weird artifact. Oh, that's a head. That is a head. Okay. Giant piano. This place is real fancy. But where is the fancy ghost behind the explosion, huh? Oh, I need to be following my navigation. I need to... I need to be more smart about this. Through into the epic dining hall. Oh. Um, I've fallen down. Why is that there? It's like a trap. The ghosts are trying to trap me now, huh? Oh, no. Oh, something literally fell from the sky. Can I go out here? Oh, I can. Let's see what happened with this explosion. To the balcony of this multi-million dollar mansion. What happened over there? Do we have a magical ghost that can summon in meteors, perhaps? Or maybe it was something even more evil. What is going on here? I've got my vacuum just in case. Hello? Ow! Ow! No, I did not mean to do that. Hello? Is anyone in here? You oh, there's a ghost down there. What kind of ghost is this going to be? And since when are there dirt stairs? Right. We're going to have to have some words. I know you missed the house. <laughs> oh, these ghosts are so ridiculous. They have really amazing lips, too. Uh, what happened here, my friend? And what's your name? Clarissa the gardening ghost. I blew up my entire garden. No wonder you've got eyes that are flickering backwards and forwards. She's seen an explosion with her very own eyes. Close up as well. I was just planting some dynamite sticks in the ground for later. And then they all just exploded. What kind of gardening are you doing around here? Now all of my flowers are gone. I've never been this upset in my entire life. What a shame. I feel like we should give her a hug. Okay, maybe not. Uh, so you're telling me that didn't that you didn't stop to consider the fact that the dynamite sticks could explode? Hmm. They don't really. They don't have brains, so you can't really blame them for that. What? No, of course not. They're not supposed to explode unless I tell them to. Which in this case, I most certainly did not. What are we gonna have to do to suck this ghost up, huh? This sucks. Everything sucks. I'm just gonna open a black hole. Oh, do not open a black hole, please. She's some kind of wizard. Some kind of witch. Ha! <laughs> Take, take that, dynamite. I'm going to hide behind here. I do not want to be sucked into a black hole. Clarissa, please change your mind. I don't find that necessary. Yeah, you, t you tell them, Benedict. I don't think she can hear you because I've only got a headset, but what is going on? Can she really conjure up something that dark? What else am I supposed to do? Think of a rational solution requires far too much effort. Besides, I've got better things to do, like destroying the planet. These ghosts are insane. She did it. She opened a black hole. <laughs> There's flowers coming out of it. I'm glad I'm standing back. Should we get a bit closer? Yeah, I'm gonna get a bit closer. What are you doing? Yeah. Nothing. Ah! Ah! Suck me in. Suck me in. Ah! I'm summoning, not summoning the flower demons from alternative dimension or anything like that. She's summoning a flower demon? 
Oh, jeez. I don't know. Probably. Oh, and by the way, I've just disabled your vacuum cleaner so you can't suck me up or anything. I'll use my ghost vision to look into the future and notice you sucking me up. Not cool. Oh, it legit doesn't work. Looks like we're going to have to find another way around this one. Ow! It keeps burning. Is she following me? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Leave me alone. Lure Clarissa into the vortex to close it. Oh, <laughs> you're going to get a taste of your own medicine, your own demise. I don't want to go in the vortex myself, though. Jeez, come over here. Ah, I died. Where is she? Where is she? There she is. Come over here, Clarissa. Go and get sucked in. Oh, yes. <laughs> we didn't get to suck up the ghost, though. I've got one less ghost in my suck among 3,000. It's not good. What now? Oh, no. That didn't sound good. Gah! What is it with a ghost and utter chaos? You should probably check the house for more ghosts, since I assure you there are more we need to find. I still need five more. Luckily, this doesn't seem like it's going to take too long. These ghosts are incredibly annoying, but also incredibly dumb. So we should be absolutely fine. Let me try and find this ghost. Back to the house. It sounds like the ghost like tripped and fell, but it's a ghost. It would just trip and then fall through the floor. So... That kind of happens. What's going on in here? I'm gonna close this just in case anyone feels like sneaking up on me. Oh, oh, there's two. There's two. What are their faces? Okay, looks like he's having a good old burp. And you look like a, a pig? Hey, Phil, you wanna have a screaming competition? Go on, go on, I'll judge it. I'll judge it, pick me, pick me, pick me. Yeah, sure, let's, have a to let's totally have a screaming competition. Which one's gonna win? I think this guy. I don't know which one's which, but this <laughs> He's got, like, the cross between a chicken and a pig's mouth. What is going on here? He, he's definitely going to win. He's got the biggest mouth. Okay, I'll go first. I mean, I could either watch this or just suck them both up. I'm going to watch it. <laughs> what a terrible scream, Bill. I'm going to guess this guy's Bill because of his beak. You call that a scream? That wasn't scary or annoying. Check this out. Go on, hit me your biggest scream. Oh! Okay, that was a good one. Bill, Bill, well done, buddy. You win. I pronounce Phil the winner. No questions. What was that? Sorry, but I can't hear you over your pathetic attempts at screaming. Can we can we interrupt this now? I've already announced. I've already announced the winner. Is this one gonna get louder? I'm worried. I'm worried. I'm a little bit scared. How about you stop whispering and start screaming? He's gonna do it, isn't he? He's actually gonna do it. I knew it. <laughs> It wasn't too loud. Can I just... I can't suck them up. Oh. Can you guys just... Oh, no. They're um, not happy with me. Can you guys just please stop? Listen, is there anything we can do? To just make you go away. We can just suck them up, Benedict. Why are you bargaining with the ghosts? No. <laughs> Actually, you could challenge us to a scream off. Oh, for goodness sake. Why? What is wrong with you guys? Hey, why would you tell him that? No, we might actually have to go. I don't want you to go. I just want you to crawl inside this vacuum and everything will be fine. Scream off. How about we just compete to see who can produce the loudest noise? Be Benedict, that's the same thing. Seems like a fine compromise. All right, first up, who's Bill and who's the other one? <laughs> Indeed, challenge accepted, Benedict. You better have a good scream in you, buddy, because I just don't. All right, Phil, let's do our thing. Hopefully, this is just a ploy to distract them both. Don't worry. I've got a plan to stop them. Hold on. Right, Benedict. Over to you, my friend. Oh. He's coming in. <gasps> what is that? Oh! <laughs> it's the helicopter. You should cover your ears. This is going to be pretty loud. It's me! Oh, no. That wasn't too bad. I was actually prepared. I, I just realized I covered my headphones and <laughs> not my ears as well. <laughs> Holy cow, that was extremely loud. So loud, in fact, that we are now dazed. Yes. We are dazed and vulnerable. Don't try to vacuum us up now. That would be pretty... I'm doing it. Come here. Pop. There we go. And... Oh. Woo. Suck up Bill and Phil. Completed. Is someone singing? Hello? Hey, there's a ghost walking by. Oh, there they are. Go follow it. You okay? You sound pretty sad. What a head of hair you have. I can see their mouth through their face as well. Look at that face. <laughs> Where are you going? You know you're being creepy when you're being the creepy one following a ghost, right? I could just literally suck her up. 
right now. But no, Benedict wants me to do it the professional way to find out what on earth is going on with these ghosts. This ghost also has a monobrow. I wonder how all these ghosts died, actually. Oh, hello. Who are you? It's Larry. Larry the singing ghost, everyone. Actually, never mind who you are. I couldn't care less. <laughs> nope. Not in the least. Well, nice to meet you too. That was a bit rude. It was Benedict. You're right. Oh dear. I'm sorry to apologize. I'll sing you a little song I've been working on for literally forever. Would you like to hear it? Yes, then I can sneak up behind you and- Oh, Benedict, come on. That was our chance. Did I hear it? <laughs> yes. Indeed I did. I love songs. Now let me begin. Ah, right, I'm ready to hear this. Beautiful. What a singing mouth you have. Ooh, Larry and Gary. So this is Larry. There's another ghost called Gary. Gary is a jerk. He means well, but really sucks. <laughs> Every day he gets in the way of my important tasks. I'm blown away by these ghosts. So today I was just sucking on some ice cubes. How? You're a ghost. Gary was like, bro, it's not okay. And then he took away my cubes. And I didn't like that one little bit. I said, bro. Like, what the flop? And then, you need to guess what happened. He walked into the desert and disappeared. My brain! Ah! You're still going. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. I really do deserve a standing ovation. I'm already standing up, buddy, but you can have a bow. I bow before you. That was beautiful. Where's Gary, though? What are you talking about? It sounded like you were deliberately trying to damage my employee's hearing. Utterly horrible. Nuh-uh. You're horrible. For that... I'm gonna suck you up. Look at his hair and eyebrow. That's phenomenal. Oh, okay. You should probably suck him up now. I can't turn on my vacuum. Oh, here we go. Bye, buddy. Sing yourself to sleep inside my vacuum. Come on. Come on, get in. Get in. Can you just get in the vacuum? These ghosts are definitely living up to their name. You don't have to be so mean about it. Just trying to be a friendly old ghost here. I'm not hurting anything. Just get in the, get in the vacuum, Larry. I don't want to hear any of your singing from in there, okay? Two to go. The attic has been unlocked, where all the spookiest of ghosts lie. Where is this attic? I need some stairs. The attic has been opened up. You should definitely check that out. Here, I plotted the location of the spiral staircase on your navigation bar. Oh, wait, 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 it's here, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Look at this, I love me a spiral staircase, not gonna lie. Let's walk up it together. To the attic, my friends, to the attic. Oh, geez, the attic. Let's go. Oh, are these cobwebs? There's real dust. There's dust everywhere. Stop where you are. Random. Oh, there's a carpet ghost. It was. <laughs> Stop where you are, random person who has happened upon this here carpet today. My name is Carpet Ghost. Now I have possessed this here carpet. Quick, vacuum him up before he goes into a stupid bit of poems or something. Get him. Get the carpet ghost. Oh, vacuum me up. What are you trying to do? Purge me from this attic. Just try. I'm a carpet. You can't get me out. He's bluffing. Just do it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Come on. Ha <laughs> ha. You fool. I am now cleaner and therefore more powerful. You will never catch me. <laughs> Where did he go? Wait, so cleanliness makes you more powerful? Mate, I reckon he's going to possess other objects, isn't he? It's like a million different objects in here. Wait, so cleanliness makes you more powerful? Yes. Why are you asking? Ah. No reason, just wondering. What is your stance on stains? Stains? Carpets hate stains. And as a carpet, I hate them too. I wonder if the kitchen is something you could use to stain the carpet with. If I were you, I'd check the pantry in the basement. Ha! You'll never stain me, for I am a ghost. And also a carpet. <laughs> we'll see about that, buddy. To run all the way back into the kitchen, I can't even remember where it is. It must be down these spiral stairs. Ah! Found it! Hopefully this dude isn't in here anymore. What can we stain a carpet with? Oh, freezer. What's in here? Pantry one. Looks like it wants me to go to pantry two. Pick up the juice in the pantry. Right click on the cup while having a dark shaded hot bar. Okay. Bar. Yeah. You found a bright red liquid. Great. I'm sure the carpet goes will absolutely abhor it. Sneak onto the carpet while holding the drink to spill it accidentally on purpose. <laughs> you got it, bro. If I remember correctly, the spiral staircase is right. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Let's spill this red stuff. It's blood, it's juice, it's jam. Who knows? Jelly could be either of the things, but it doesn't matter. I'm going to run and I'm going to spill it. Oh! <laughs> Look how angry he is. No way. Are you serious? That was my favorite carpet. Gosh, Steven did the exact same thing last week when he tracked mud all over me. Luckily, that stain wasn't too difficult to remove. Did he just sniff? Look at 
tiniest little nose to sniff. Is that red juice? Dang it. I was really hoping to have to endure the ordeal of removing another stain, but apparently the entire universe is against me or something because people keep pouring stuff all over my carpet. You know what? I'm done. I don't know what else to do. I have lived and died for that carpet, and now that it is quintessentially a piece of garbage, I'm just going to leave to find another carpet to possess. Um, is carpet ghost all right? He seems pretty distressed. Never mind. You've been captured, sir. Uh, who keeps vacuuming up all of the ghosts around here? Uh, where? where did that come from? It sounded like in here. We've only got one more ghost. I can hear you. I'm in the great room, you dinko doinks. <laughs> <laughs> there is a bridge that's suspended over the great room. You should go and check out what's happening from there. A br oh, there's the bridge. All right, what is your guy's deal? Where is he? Like, stop sucking up ghosts for one flip flopping minute. It's not our so fault. What? Just because you make some money doesn't mean it's okay. Oh, oh, I don't oh. know, foreshadowing? Like, maybe a bridge is about to collapse or something. <laughs> hey, it could be. Uh-oh. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> ah! uh, yeah, yeah, that was the bridge. <laughs> hey, how are you holding up? I bet falling like 30 meters must have hurt, huh? This dude, look at his face. He's so angry. I love him. He's perfect. Oh, no, 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 wait. Mr. Evil Ghost, this ghost hunter was being mean. You can't watch in here doing stuff like this. Is there something wrong with you? <laughs> Nothing is wrong with me. Maybe something is wrong with you that being all dead and stuff. For. Sorry, sorry. Your face is uncalled for. You just infuriate me. Your arrogance is just astonishing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my goodness. You just dropped my poor ghost hunter from a 30 meter tall bridge. How about I don't keep my mouth shut? I like flapping my lips up and down and sideways. It just feels so good. Same. Are you typically this annoying? You know what? Suck him up, please. I can't stand any more of this. I'm on it, boss. Okay, okay. Evil. Ha! You're pathetic. The worst you've done thus far, aside from killing my worker. Thus far, you have been incredibly annoying. You are very annoying, too. The only annoying thing here is yourself. No, don't suck me up. Stop listening to whatever it is. I can't get him! I can't get him at all! Well, then stop listening to Benedict. Don't you know that Benedict is a war criminal? What? <laughs> yes, we're aware. Wait, what? <laughs> no, don't listen to him. He probably eats bugs or something. Hey, can I have your vacuum? No. Uh-oh. Oh, dude, we get to choose a side? I kind of like the evil ghost. He's cute, but also evil. And then, but Benedict's a war criminal, which is pretty much the epitome of evil. Maybe the evil ghost is Benedict. Who do I choose? Who do I choose? Who do I choose? Let's go for, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go Benedict, right? But I don't like Benedict. Benedict, I'll do it. I'm clicking it. Come on. That is like so inconvenient. Can't you just like give it to me? Oh no. I guess I'll just have to fight you for it. No, I don't wanna fight. I don't wanna fight. I don't wanna fight. Oh, no. Survive evil ghost minions attacks and suck him up when he's vulnerable. Why didn't I just side with him? Can I can I redo this again? Where are the minions? What are the minions? This music is epic. Oh, 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 oh. I'm scared. I can't even see them. He's trapped me in this tiny room all by myself. Oh, there they are. There he is. There he is. There he is. Come here. Come here right now. Come here. I can't get him. I'm going around this way. Yes. Gotcha. Can I not get him? Is this even him? <laughs> His face cracks me up. Oh, jeez. It's SpongeBob. But the evil version. Ah! Can I suck these guys up? Nope, nope, definitely don't do that. Okay. There he is, there he is, there he is. Oh, that's the wrong one. I can't even see them from behind. Now they're zapping me with lightning. Oh, no. I've struck myself with a lightning bolt. I'm all dazed and vulnerable. Dang it. Get him, get him, get him. Yeah. Look at his stars. <laughs> it was vulnerable for a little bit. We did it. We did it. We need to do that multiple times, though. I think I just need to run around. And as long as I don't get hurt, then I'm fine. Oh, my goodness. These guys are actually kind of terrifying. Look at them. They look like a withered tree that's got some kind of tree disease. <laughs> that's what they look like. Go on. Zap the lightning. I dare you. They've lost track of me because their eyes aren't really real. They're just drawn on. What you going to do next, huh? I need you to zap yourself with lightning again, please. I think he's going to do it. They keep disappearing and stuff. Go away. Oh, there's more. I thought it was disappearing. He was making new ones. Absolutely not. 
Ah! I actually got zapped that time. Here we go. Here we go. Turn it on. Zap him. I'm just going to stand here. Come on. This will work. Yeah, I'm getting hurt. It doesn't matter. Take him up for the team. Got him. Yes. Congratulations, Ghost Hunter. You've just completed your first mission working for No Mo Ghost Co. Here's your reward. Give me some money. Give me some sweet cash, please. That's right. You win absolutely nothing except for the gratitude associated with the successful act of brutally vacuuming up a dozen innocent ghosts. You thought you'd get paid for this? Well, maybe you should have looked a little closer at the contract because it explicitly stated that I'm allowed to totally scam you. For goodness sake, time to head back to the garage for a quick break. Uh, then we'll make our way to another mansion later tonight. Go through the front door and meet me out front. I'll pick you up in the heli van. Benedict, I, I knew it. You're a war criminal. I should have betrayed you because you have betrayed me. Where's the heli van? Come here. Oh. Oh no, this doesn't sound good. I don't like these horror tones. Benedict? Are you okay? Hello? Oh no, something's happening. Hmm, that was odd. I think something is up. <laughs> Who is this? I think that's Benedict. I think he's a ghost. He was a ghost all along. This is all a dream, isn't it? Oh, Snuggleda, Snuggleda. Who was Snuggleda? What happened? He just. Oh. Is it gonna. What happened? <laughs> Who's this? What are you doing here? <laughs> it was, <laughs> I was captured by Ben. Is that Benedict? That was Benedict, wasn't it? I I'm sure Benedict is like an old name for some kind of creepy clown. That's my theory. Benedict was behind the whole thing. He got me to suck up all his friends so he could take over and be the, the, the almighty pink evil ghost. My goodness. This is great. This is so good. We hope you enjoyed. I did. That was awesome. Such a well-made map as well. There was a lot of like talking, but it was so good. The gameplay was good, but simple. I love that, guys. If you enjoyed another little adventure into Minecraft and the world of what people can create right now and the world of the um, annoying ghosts, then please leave a like. That'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you are brand spanking new for more gameplays just like this every single day. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Good bye. Wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.